Hello everyone and welcome back to another Gary's Mod video. Today we are checking out GM Dreams. Link of the map will be in the description down below. Please go go support the original map creator. Um, this kind of looked like a liminal space type of map, a dream type of map, which I love. Love those. I talked about this in a recent video. I, I just love maps based off of dreams. And, uh, yeah. My eyes are like really weird recently. This feels super bright. Everything looks so bright to me. But uh, anyways, let's check this out. We got three ways we can go. We can go through this door, down that way, or that way. And I, I couldn't tell you which way I want to go, but I am curious on, on this. Oh, this is cool as hell. Let's go through here first. I like that they kind of look like miniature buildings, in a way. You can hear cars being parked and whatnot, which is kind of creepy. Sounds like helicopters. Now I'm very curious on what's through here. It feels like I'm in, like very tall or something or this place is well, it is very small. It's really interesting. It's back here. I had left my mark. Just seeing if there's any secrets behind these little buildings here. I don't want to miss nothing. I was like, what's that? And then I just remembered my dumbass just put that down right there. I was like, what is that? Zero. Is this like the back room? Back rooms with different levels? This is like a store of some sort. That's empty. With no checkout. Which is kind of creepy. No checkout for a store. No wonder these shelves are empty. They don't even have to pay. I like the purple glow from this area here. It's kind of cool. There's a very soft s sound coming from this room, but it's very quiet. I'm just kind of pressing E on everything to see if I can interact with it, but I don't think so. Kind of creepy. Alright. Well, that was an interesting little spot there. Let's, I guess, head back. This room is a little loud. With the humming. Let's go this way, though. I tried to turn it down so you guys could hear me better, and it wasn't too loud. Can't do nothing with that. Oh, this is weird looking. Just an empty area with a pool here. You can see through the door as well. It's kind of trippy. Just a chill little room here, I guess. But like I said, I feel like I'm really tall in these rooms for some reason. Except this one.
The, roof, the floor looks super bumpy right here. I don't know. Can we... Okay, we can walk here. This is really weird. I just realized even the walls are. And so is the roof. little dark here, gonna turn on a flashlight. Oh, this is weird. Kinda looks like we're underneath a road of some sort. Lighting is very creepy, but what's over here? I really like the contrast of like some areas being daytime and then some night. Like, this is a very, like, uh, what, what's the name of a picture that kind of shows, like, the contrast of lighting? I forgot the name of it. I was in photography, and that was, like, something I actually enjoyed. Um, but it had a name. Yeah, I can't, I can't remember the name of it, but it reminds me of, uh, this right here reminds me of this, uh, picture of, uh, these uh, streets, I think, somewhere in London. And it's like a street view of these streets, and uh, it, it shows, like, the lighting very well, because, like, some parts are, like, pitch black, and some parts are, like, light, because there's, like, this dark alleyway. And it's a real picture, too. It's not, like, edited, because it's really... It was taken with, like, a pinhole camera. And, uh... There's like this very dark alleyway, this is a very old one, and uh, the lighting from like this, these buildings really darken this one area, and then, the, and then uh, on like the right side, there's like flowers, and it's it's really bright. It's it's a cool picture. If I can find it, I'll put it up on screen, but I probably won't be able to find it because I don't know the name of it. But it was a cool picture. But uh. That's what this reminds me of, seeing the contrast of these two rooms. It's really cool. And that's what I love about Liminal Spaces. It's it's just art, you know. Some of it's art, and then some of it's very plain. But I like this place, because it feels really artistic. Then we got this. This is just really cool. I actually really like this right here. Sorry. Now, now I'm just the tourist again. This is kind of creepy, though, the way that there's, like, these little areas here. Then we got this. What an interesting view. That's so cool. This is such a cool contrast between the two. But this... I'm very curious about this. You know, looking through here, I kind of thought this was like a floating island because my eyes weren't like adjusted to what that was yet. So it kind of looked like it was a floating island with a dead tree on it. Well, this is pretty cool too. I wonder if that tree gets enough water. <laughs> Funny. That's really cool though. Actually, this might be the thumbnail. This is just a cool room right here. I'm sorry, I keep taking pictures. They're cool, man. Well, we're going through here, I guess. We got this pot right here. I wonder if I did anything. I, I didn't really try to pick it up. I should have done that first just to see if it did something, but it's broken now. So it don't matter because it's not there no more. I don't think I've seen a room look like this before in Gary's Mod. This is actually kind of cool. I don't recognize this texture at all. 
Oh, this is so cool. It kind of reminds me of, uh, that one section in Amnesia before you go to, like, uh, spoilers, I guess. To, like, see all the torturing devices where everything is super big and open, and then there's, like, the fog in the sky, and then the pillars. It kind of reminds me of that. And you're, like, running around, running from, uh, the monsters. This is kind of what the room, this room reminds me of. But this is super cool. It looks like there's something to the left here, or maybe to the right. No, it's on the left. A snowy room. Just a snowy area now. This is... Bizarre. There's like a little house out there. You guys remember Monsters Inc? Where uh, th th this is what this reminds me of. Um, Monsters Inc. When they go through that door and it's all snowy. I don't really remember Monsters Inc. But that kind of that's what that reminds me of. But we got a cool little bench here. Kind of wish people would put like invisible seats so you can sit down. And at benches and just kind of look around. This is very cool. Let's go check out that uh, little cabin house I saw over here, whatever it was. Looks really abandoned. My game just crashed. That was really weird. I'm gonna go back to where I was. Just to see if it does it again. Alright, and we are back. Let's go see if it crashes again. Otherwise, I might think it's intentional. Okay, so it did crash. It actually did crash again, so I think that that is either intentional or that is an actual glitch. That's actually kind of creepy either way. I feel like that should be kept in unless there's something really cool in there. I just came back into the game and I spawned in, uh, in here now. Weird. I think I recognize this, though. Maybe? No, I do not. This is a different area. I do- I thought I looked in through here, though. Maybe from here. We're gonna jump and run really quick here. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's kind of stay on the path. Let's try to find the path that we were on before. Did we come down this way at all? I don't believe so, actually. So let's let's head back into the hallway. We're, we'll save this side for, you know, later in the video. Let's get back to where we were. Alright, we're back in here. So we couldn't pick it up. No matter what. But I did break it again, so there's that as well. I broke it again. I'm sorry. But, uh, let's get back to that really cool hallway, which I think is right here. Let's just pass by to where we were. The the cursed uh, crashing room. I wonder if that was intentional, like I said. Like, I don't know if that was intentional or not, but that was cool. Either way. Is this just a dead end? Kinda, but we got this room here. We were in here. Alright, uh, that played some copyrighted music, sadly had to reset the map again. <laughs> uh, 
uh, because I couldn't turn it off, but, uh, it was cool. If you guys want to listen to that, map will be in the, you know, description down below, and you can check this place out for yourself. And I recommend leaving a like on the Steam page workshop for this map. They worked hard on this. It's very unique. I'm kind of glad to be playing another map like this. And this goes right back to the beginning. And then we got this room, which I believe led to uh, this place that was very familiar. Never mind, this wasn't familiar. Oh, I don't like that, though. I'm not going to go down there yet. I want to look at this place. This is going to sound really stupid, but this reminds me of a Minecraft build, build I made once, right here. Oh, we can't get over here. Um, I feel like a lot of people have built something similar to this, though, but it just kind of reminds me of, like, this little area I made with, like, this fence and then the roof overhead with vines like that. And there's a forest. I know that's, that's just random, but it came to my mind. I had to mention it. But that's a cool little spot here. This is my favorite spot, actually, so far. As a matter of fact, I took a picture of it. With this right here. Oh, hell. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Okay, goodbye. Okay, goodbye. Take your time. I'm leaving you behind. Best song. <laughs> I'm, I'm not going back in there. That's creepy. I feel like I've activated some kind of... Oh, is that new? I don't know. But, I'm going to look out for more of those, just in case. I didn't realize that there's like a little door here. Wait, this is different. This is a different area. Is it? Whoa. Okay, I was looking at this in the wrong way. Because I never went through that area through this way. But I'm curious on what's over here. Cool little alleyway. That's nasty. Disgusting. Absolutely foul. Okay, do we look at everything then? We have not been here. Oh, this is creepy. I, f I feel anxiety already. Tell us a joke. I really want to get up there. I'm gonna no clip up here. What's the deal with airline food? <laughs> that gives me anxiety being up here. Can I tell you all a joke? 
Okay. They didn't respond, so I'm not gonna tell a joke. These look like eyes, and this is like one wide open mouth. Boxes. I gotta break these. Nothing here. Doesn't that look like a silhouette of a person? I've seen these before. In a map I played recently, it's it's very creepy. Oh, this is cool. I'm afraid of those water things showing up. That would scare the absolute shit out of me right now. Like those little things that show up in the water. You know what I'm talking about? Like in Half-Life 2. And they... They start swimming around you and hurting you. Cause they're mean. Yeah, those things. Alright. Can't really think of anywhere else I need to go, or can go. Except maybe down here. I'm gonna no clip a little bit now. We've been there, we've been there. I think we've been everywhere. Everywhere we know. I'm curious to see if, uh,. I can move a camera over here, maybe. I forgot how they work, though. Let's, let's go. I don't want to get too close to it now. It'd be so creepy if there's somebody in here. Wait, it's letting me actually get close to it. Oh, I don't know if I want to see what's in here. Oh, I think it's lagging. I deleted the camera. I don't. I don't think I'm supposed to get to this. All right. Well, I think that was it. My game crashed again. I thought I could be sneaky and get the camera over there. I did make more progress. I don't know if this is like intentional or not, but if anybody can try to get into that room, I say go for it. Um, I recommend playing the map for yourself. Of course, support the original creator, like I always say. Sorry this is ending off with a blank screen, but uh, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed, though. I really had a lot of fun here. But I think I'm going to end this off here. I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. Thank you guys for watching this far. Leave a like if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see more content like this. And as always, as, 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 as always uh, support the original map creator. And I will see you all in the next one. Peace out, be safe, and goodbye.